welcome back viewers after a long time i am making new videos so i am starting from today i will continue to make new videos because i have posted uh, videos up to the year end and uh, into the beginning of the new year so i think up to february i have posted videos so i thought maybe i should now make uh, more videos so i am starting from today so I was thinking about the topics on which I can make the video then uh, this cosmic desktop come to my mind. So as we all know the cosmic desktop is under uh, rapid development by the pop OS team and the alpha is uh, there will be two alphas and by the end of May cosmic desktop will be ready. So the two alphas will get passed and maybe uh, in the month of June. Uh, they will have a beta rollout of the cosmic uh, desktop along with the pop os 24.04 so uh, we are very much confident that we will have a working uh, pop os by the end of june most probably so i would like to share some of the screenshots of the new cosmic desktop that is under development so the pop os on the reddit uh, Channel, they have posted uh, some screenshots so we'll take the look at the screenshots posted by the pop os their official screenshot you can see this is the reddit uh, page for pop os and here is the screenshot so let us check out the screenshots so this is the screenshot of the cosmic desktop main screen you can see the top panel it is vertical the dock is there at the bottom the new wallpaper you can see looks very stunning very very good looking and uh, i think uh, the pop os is now moving away from this brownish kind of look on the interface so it is getting a fresh looks and it is uh, discarding the brownish look to the interface all uh, all over the pop os all the interfaces they, they tended to look black and brown so I think uh, now the pop OS is moving away from that kind of loop. Let us go ahead. You can see here it is written the panels are fully customized. So this panel you can put it anywhere top on the both sides while the dock will remain at the bottom. And this is the setting to change the appearance of the pop OS. You can see the ascent colors that are available. I think we will be able to add custom ascent colors also. You can change the uh, text palette tint. You can change the primary container background. You can apply neutral palette tint. So the new appearance settings feature a lot of options. Note, notice the import export button. So suppose you do some customizations to your desktop, then you can export those customizations. So it will be saved in some file and later on if you uh, to the reinstallation of your pop os you can import that uh, customization file and you can get those settings back and also you can export to the customization file and that customization file you can replicate or you can use that on multiple desktops laptops or you can share with your friends or family also so definitely the development of pop os is going in the right direction i should say and this is the settings for the applet you can see workspaces button applications button day date time calendar input sources notification tray tiling menu sound bluetooth this is the new applets menu featuring a nice drag and drop solution to rearrange the applets it's possible to make the numerous layouts with this settings for the applet so that that is also going in the right direction and here you can see the lots of options for setting up volume uh, devices here so you can set up uh, your sound devices using this uh, settings for the sound so output input alerts application volumes and settings everything can be done from one place in the settings uh, settings app or settings menu of pop os and this is the wallpaper selection you can see if you use more than one monitor and like to have different wallpapers in each one we will be able to enjoy the new wallpaper setting so you can have a different wallpaper for each of your monitor 
so that is possible or you can have same background on all displays so just uh, quick toggles are there and you can uh, fit the wallpaper image or the background image so there are different kinds of uh, uh, you can say settings like field stretch zoom then slideshow also is possible so you can have uh, active uh, this uh, backgrounds or you can make the slideshow so uh, different wallpapers will be displayed on the screen at different times and also you can change the system by uh, this uh, backgrounds so some of the wallpapers are seen here so i think uh, for some days or maybe uh, a week or two the pop os team will likely share the wallpapers that have already been finalized with the general public so it will create some wow and some appreciation and some uh, we can say anxiety uh, not anxiety some we can say uh, more curiosity among the users because i think this pop os 24.04 is going to be the best pop os release till date i can certainly say from what the screenshots they have shared here let us go ahead so this is the display configuration or display settings it shows a complete uh, settings ui it may look different in the final version so i think they are still doing some uh, tweaks to this uh, display settings but yes uh, looking at what it, it is shown here it is fantastic the work they have done is very fantastic and fractional scaling is available so traditionally pop os uh, has fractional scaling uh, it, it works in pop os and they are continuing with the fractional scaling in pop os cosmic desktop also and here you can see you can put the panels in any side as i said meaning that there is lot of nice possibilities here as well as custom workflow so you can uh, place the panel to suit your workflow you can uh, do the customizations to suit your workflow and you can save those customizations also i have shown you how it will be saved so maybe if for this panel also there will be some feature to save where it was i just create yes import export buttons for the appearance maybe they will have some kind of this feature for uh, your uh, rising also so if they bring some feature where you can your rising can be saved as a uh, customization file custom file uh, or the settings file then it will be very great now here you can see the wallpaper the default is light thing notice the uh, top panel is floating so the panel is floating now and you can move the panel anywhere on the three sides and maybe we can also move the dock to the top and you can make uh, take the panel down also maybe that is also possible and you can see the wallpaper there they have created for the new uh, cosmic desktop and here you can see the password prompt everything looks screen so this is the login screen of pop os 22.04 uh, cosmic desktop looks very clean neat and it, it is looking uh, fabulous i can say and now you can see this is the uh, pop launcher it looks more refined than what is uh, in the uh, pop os uh, 22.04 it is uh, better so they have improved enhanced the features of uh, this launcher in pop os 22.04 uh, 24.04 lts so this this is going to come in the next release of pop os maybe they will release the pop os in month of june i think june uh, la last uh, fortnight or uh, maybe end of june they should release the pop os 24.04 looks very beautiful and very refined looks are there and this is the wallpaper settings so here you can see the wallpaper settings menu and the wallpaper this this wallpaper is the uh, from the older version but uh, the new uh, this uh, settings uh, looks very good in the on the screen with the backdrop of the older wallpaper from the older version of pop os 
and this is the panel settings UI and uh, you can see the column layout so the column layout is also given so you can see panel automatically hide panel position on screen show on this uh, show on display gap between the panel and screen edges extend panel to the screen edges appearance so you can make it match the desktop so whenever you change the ascent colors you change the wallpaper it will match the desktop you can change the size of uh, uh, this panel so you can uh, slide uh, use the slide to have infinite uh, infinite sizes for the panels so there is a very uh, fine control for the size of the panel and you can also change the background opacity of the panel and you can configure the panel applets so it is going in the very very right direction i just uh, uh, you can say I just uh, tr uh, I, I cannot stop falling in love superbly they have done the work so workspace orientation so you can have the workspaces either horizontally or vertically and also you can configure the trackpad gestures you can see these different gestures you can configure you can have the thumbnail placement on left or right side so very good work and now the multi monitor users will low cosmic so here you can see you can configure dynamic workspaces fixed number of workspaces workspaces span displays displays of separate workspaces the wallpaper configuration everything is there in one place and finally the configuration for the dock so all the typical uh, dock configuration will be there So now the cosmic dock is back as a native feature. Notice the dock applet. So there will be some dock applets also. So we will uh, check this out when the system is released. And I'm trying uh, to install this. So once the Pop OS 24.04 will be released, I'm going to install and use it in production. So I will get a better idea and then I will share uh, my observations with you. I think this is going to be very popular distro once the cosmic desktop and the pop os 24.04 will be released it is going uh, it is going to get up in the charts popularity charts right now it is in the top 10 in distro watch definitely it is going to get in the top 5 and you can see the ascent colors how it will look so the greenish type of accent is added configure and this this is how it will look on the your ui desktop cosmic desktop ui this is how it looks when when you add a greenish type of accent color in the uh, accent color choice cosmic text editor mockup so this is the mockup for the cosmic text editor so there will be a lot of uh, native pop os applications the text editor is one of them then what is this you can change completely colors of theme so you can change the assigned colors of theme also you can see here so this is purplish theme uh, assigned color they are applied to the pop os theme so you can change the colors and now the native fast and slick tiling so the, there are there will be some tweaks to the tiling so this is how the tiling will look and this is the highlighted uh, tiling so whatever in, uh, keyboard inputs will uh, be given they will be applied to this uh, tile window which is in the foreground and this is the background tile window so cpu will service the foreground that is the highlighted window and this is the unhighlighted window is the background process or background window it will not get priority in the resource usage so i am telling you this it is already this feature is already there in the older pop os also and applets are not only customizable customizable but they are very powerful implemented with a well developed and safe api this one looks amazing yes so you can see it is very clear to observe very clear to understand the text, the fonts that are used, everything is uh, very user friendly. So, uh, user uh, will not miss any of the settings when uh, the design is like this. 
so that is this this is the cosmic desktop under development by the pop os team so we will uh, keep a note on this and we will track the progress also so you can also track the progress i will leave this link in the video description you can always follow them on reddit they will keep updating about the development of the pop os 24.04 and the cosmic desktop also uh, try to follow them in the pop os official blog on the website there also the news of the new desktop and uh, pop os 24.04 lts will be shared with the users so now i will stop the video here see you in the next video bye bye